Hey everyone, my name is Persh and welcome back in another video on Just a Tech YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you another way to run Jekrain on your Windows machine and jailbreak your iPhone 5s to iPhone X on iOS 12, iOS 13 and the latest iOS 14. Last time on my channel, I made a video on the Jekrain Windows 0.12.2 that is by a custom ISO file that is modified by me. But in this video, I'm going to show you another ISO file that is Jeknix method. It's a 50 MB ISO file to run Jekrain on your Windows machine and you can easily jailbreak your iPhone 5s to iPhone X and the other iPads and iPods supported by the Jekrain jailbreak. And also you can do the same procedure on the activation lock devices. So if you are a normal user or a activation lock device, you can easily jailbreak with this method. And one more important thing, if you are jailbreak your iPhone 8, 8 Plus and iPhone X A11 devices with the Jekrain 0.12.2, you may encounter some errors like error getting passcode state parsing error i have already posted the fix on my youtube community post so for this kind of error you need to jailbreak with the old version that is checkrin 0.12.1 i have already posted a video on the checkrin 0.12.1 iso file so links in the description you can watch that video and it will work for you now to download the checknix iso file check the description blog link and you will get the direct download link from there now after the download you will first get the zip file first you need to extract it so you can use any zip extractor or Evinra. after that you will get the iso file so now we have to make this iso file bootable so for that we will use the belenature tool and do not use the rufus tool for making the bootable because if you use the rufus tool it will give you the grub loader error at the time of the booting so make sure that you will use the belenature for making the usb bootable now after that insert your USB pen drive and click on the flash from file and locate the file you have just downloaded. Now after that click on flash and wait for it to get complete. Now the flash process is done, just close the Belenature tool and click on cancel. After that you need to restart your PC. Now you need to go to your BIOS settings or a boot manager setting and you need to select your pen drive to boot from it. So BIOS shortcut key or a boot manager shortcut key may be different for your PC model so you can google it according to that. And after that just select your pen drive from the list. Now you will see Checknix 1.1.6 version is loading and you can see some sort of verbos booting is on the screen. Now you will see some option to run Checkrain on the CLI mode or a GUI mode or a Odyssey rain. So for the Checkrain you have to press the Alt plus F2 on your keyboard and then the Checkrain will load up automatically. So just press Alt plus F2. Now on the screen you can see the Checkrain 0.12.2 latest version is load. Now you need to connect your device, so I will show you to jailbreak iOS 12 to the latest 12.5 and iOS 14 to the 14.3 so you can follow the same procedure and I will also show you how to jailbreak the activation lock devices. So after that you have to connect your device and hit on trust on the device and click on next and first your device will be get into recovery mode automatically. After that you have to follow the instruction on the screen like you have to put your device into DFU mode so you can follow the button combination on the screen as per your device. Now it starts jailbreaking your device. If you are on iPad mini 2 or iPhone 5s, you may encounter to stuck on the right before trigger error. So for that you need to unplug and replug your device immediately after it gets stuck on the right before trigger and it will continue booting. Or you can also watch this checkrin error fix video, it will help you. So now after that you will see all done, that means the jailbreak is successful. After that you can remove your USB cable. Now connect your device with the Wi-Fi and wait for the check-in loader to appear on your home screen.
now it's here now just open the check in loader and you will get the Syria option just click on that I have already installed the Syria previously so it will asking me to reinstall or install Syria again but Syria is crashing because I have just jailbreak so now you have to reinstall or install Syria after that Syria will work now let's open the Syria now as you can see it's working perfectly so this is how you can jailbreak iOS 12.0 to the latest 12.5 on iPhone 5s, iPad mini 2, iPhone 6, 6 plus that means you can easily jailbreak iOS 12 now I will show you the latest version that is iOS 14.3 now for iOS 14, 14.1, 14.2 or 14.3 you have to take care of some points so if you are on iPhone 8, 8 plus, iPhone X that is A11 devices you have to allow the skip A11 BPR check option before you jailbreak because if you don't allow this option it will not jailbreak your device so this is only for the A11 devices for the other devices on iOS 14 like iPhone 6s, iPhone 7, 7 plus or other iPad models models you can proceed normally and one more thing on a11 devices after the jailbreak you cannot set the passcode or a face id or a touch id on only in a11 devices for that you need to wait for the next check in update and in the rest of the devices everything will work after the jailbreak so jailbreak is done now let's wait for the check in loader sometimes check in loader is not appear directly on your home screen because sometimes it's directly go to your app library so if it's not showing on your home screen you can just go to your app library and you can search for the check crane and it will show in that and if it's still not showing in the app library also you can make the app shortcut from the settings or you can try to re jailbreak again and it will surely work for you now the CD is installed properly and everything is working so this is how you can jailbreak the latest iOS 14.3 from iPhone 6s to iPhone X. Now let's come to the last device that is on the activation lock. You can follow the same procedure for iOS 12, iOS 13, iOS 14 on the activation lock devices like iPhone 5s to iPhone X and the other supported iPad models. So you can check out the all model details on the Checkrin official website. So now it's done and as you can see on the screen it's showing all done that means jailbreak is done. Now after that you can easily bypass this device from the bypass videos on my channel. So you can check out the description link or go to my channel. You will get so many tutorials on every tool to bypass iOS 12, iOS 13 and the latest iOS 14 to 14.3. Now going back to your windows machine all you need to do is you need to press ctrl plus alt plus del on your keyboard and your system will be automatically reboot and you will get back to your windows machine. So that's all for this video hit the like button and share with your friends so till then goodbye take care and peace out.